And the vacuum pump is powerful enough that when he turns it on, it's going to suck this plywood down right through the MDF. That allows us to cut through the plywood into a, a throwaway spoil board. Then the machine is going to go over, home itself, so it knows its start point. It probably already has the tool that it's going to use, but throughout the cutting of it, it will change tools. You see down at the end, it's got a dozen different, different tools to go by. Uh, the last thing he'll pick up is the scarf bit, which is custom ground to the 6.5 to 1 scarf ratio that the designer recommended. That allows, uh, it seems like a short scarf ratio. If it was any bigger than that, you'd get a hard point when the planks down. You'd actually have a spot in the plywood where the scarf was, was stiffer than the plywood itself, and that would show up in the finished product. So he's going to turn the vacuum on first. He's going to fire the machine up. All the programming has been done already. Um, everything is run from here. We don't have a computer screen. That's all in the other room where there's no dust.